Hey there, I'm Benjamin from Love's Data. In this video, we're going to have a look at the comparison toggle, which has been added to Google Analytics. So to use this, let's start by navigating to reports. This is where we'll be able to create comparisons and use the new toggle feature. So at the top here, we can see that we can actually create a comparison, but let's actually drill down. Let's travel through to acquisition and then the traffic acquisition report. I wanted to use this report because it concludes comparisons as well as filters. Basically, they're very similar, but a comparison allows you to have different sections of traffic presented in the one report, while filtering is narrowing the focus onto one of those particular sections. So comparisons allow us to compare different sections in the same report. So let's click on add comparison. And we can see on the right hand side, we can add our conditions to build our comparison. So what we're going to do is we're going to start by creating a comparison for people who found the website through organic search. So let's do a quick um, search for session uh, default channel group. And I'm going to select that dimension on the right. And then we can choose the match type. I'm going to keep things simple. Let's just go with exactly matches, but you can use one of the other match types if you need. And then I'm going to look for organic search. And so now what we've done is we've built our conditions and we can click apply on the bottom right hand corner. So now what we can see is we can see that our comparison is in the report. So we're now looking at all of the users on, in this case, the Google Merchandise Store, which is Google's demo property for Google Analytics, um, as well as our particular comparison, which is for people who have found the website using organic search. And this new feature here is the toggle. So here what we can see is by default, now that we've created our comparison, it is on by default. And the really nice thing about the comparison toggle is now as we travel between different reports, it'll actually see that our comparison stays there. And as soon as we want to add that comparison back to the report, we just switch it on. So this means that as we're traveling through Google Analytics, we can use all of the different reports and that comparison we've created is sticky. So we can continue to enable it and turn it off as we actually travel through Google Analytics. So that's the new comparison toggle feature that's available for us. And I also just want to highlight, this is a great new feature to begin using. And what I'd love to see is I'd love to see this actually applied to all of the reports by default. So Hopefully in the future, we'll be able to create these as an administrator or editor in Google Analytics and apply them to all of the reports that people are using inside Google Analytics. If you'd like to learn even more about Google Analytics 4, then take a moment to check out my courses. I've included a link in the description below this video. And of course, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.